Here's how to fix iMessage activation error. Now, if you're trying to activate your iMessage, but it's just not working, there are a few steps that you can go through to get those fixed and get your iMessage up and running. Now, if we open up a web browser, there is an Apple web page that walks you through some steps. I'm gonna walk through these steps along with a few other tricks that you can take to get that iMessage activated and working. So it says you might see these messages waiting for activation, activation unsuccessful. They might look something like this, iMessage activation, an error occurred during activation, try again. So what it does it say to do? It says make sure that you're connected to a cell data or Wi-Fi network. So you need a good internet connection, obviously, to activate that iMessage. So let's just open up a new browser window and we're going to type in speed test here and run a speed test to make sure you have a good and stable internet connection so that you can activate your iMessage and connect to the iMessage servers. So now that we've done that, we can go on to the next step. If you're using an iPhone, you need SMS activated. Potentially your carrier might you know, charge you for those SMS. And then it says go to settings, go to general and date and time and make sure you've set that date and time automatically. So let's go there. Let's go to settings. Oh, let me go all the way back. We're just going to go to general and then on here, midway down date and time. Now you can see here set automatically is turned on. If that is toggled off, then just make sure that's turned on because sometimes that iMessage can have issues. If you set that date, maybe sometime in the back or the, you know, past or into the future or something like that. If it's not set automatically to the current date and time, then that will cause issues. Now you can do a few other things. Let's go back again and we'll go to messages here and we'll just toggle off iMessage and then toggle it back on to see if we can activate it again. So just try toggling it off and then on again and see if that fixes it. If it still doesn't fix it, we can go back and we will tap on general here and then scroll down to transfer or reset iPhone. And then we'll hit reset and reset network settings. So you'll just enter in the password for your phone here and you'll want to reset those network settings. A lot of times this fixes any kind of bugs where you're trying to connect from your phone to some kind of a network or some kind of server that's not working. So reset those network settings and you should be good to go. Now, the last thing that you can do is you could force restart your phone. A lot of times this fixes bugs too. So let's tap on the volume up, the volume down, and then tap and hold on the power button. So volume up, volume down, tap and hold on the power button. And you'll just slide to power off your phone there. And once you powered it off, you'll just restart it and it should be good to go. Your iMessage should be activating and working as normal. Hope this helps. If you have any questions on that, leave them in the comments down below and I'll catch you on the next one.